Okay, y'all. It's day 28. We haven't got anything to call in a few days. It's been slow. We got a few crappie yesterday with Ben. That was fun, but not quite what we're looking for. We're back out here at the lake today. We're going to kind of run the same patterns that we did yesterday. Stay on the bank. Find shallow coves and uh, see if we can't get on them today. I'm sure we will find something bedding up today. The question is, is it going to go 17 and three quarters of an inch? Because that's what we need. Got to call one inch for that 300 inch mark. And uh, anything after that, I'm going to feel like that's a major win. That's a really good bag of 16 fish for a month. So, especially around here. Got to think about that in the middle of Kansas. Little town. Middle of nowhere. So, we are going to waste no more time because the rain just let up and we're going to rip some lip. Got this grub on for the Bass Slingers Bait Challenge, and I'm hearing a couple fish splash around over here, so I'm gonna stay quiet and try to cast on this bank down here. There's one. There's a decent one. That's decent. No, it's not. It just feels good because it's a stinking white bass. The stinking white bass. It's not even a good one. It's just quite so weird. <sighs> On Species Wednesday. I guess we're going to move because this is bunch of these guys and I don't have ice for my cooler so I'm rolling up on the spot check this out dang y'all need stickers hit me up Ten pounds. well wasn't recording but got me a silly little drum on the dang pelletail grub choked it too man the fish I am looking for Okay, I guess this out. Look how pretty that freaking fish is. I mean, I know it's a dumb, ugly drum, but he's got some pretty iridescence on him. Golly, that hook is really in him. Hey, he's trying to spike me. God. Woo, that's a close one. Yep. Not what we're looking for, but. Fish nonetheless. Okay, bye, dude. That's the littlest crappie in the world, and he straight up choked that. <laughs> Look at that jig is, guys. I'm not gonna get that out of his mouth. Look at how tiny and cute he is. You know, I'm not gonna be able to get that out. Do I just throw him back in his bait? Can I crush his head a little bit? I don't know. But I cannot get that freaking thing out of there. We're just gonna throw him in his bait because I can't do anything about it. Either he'll come off of there or he won't. What are you gonna do? There's the crappie. Tiny crappie. I bet that didn't feel good. Oh, I got it out. There you go, guy. Okay. Swim away. Thank you. 
talk about a wrong species Wednesday. Everything caught on this grub. Ah. Just want to, I mean, it's fun catching fish and all, but two more days left in this tournament, I'd like to cull that one inch out. You know what I mean? I've got a pretty good feeling that there isn't any more bass over there. I and mean, it's a lot of crappie. That was a hit. There's a little bass. And there he goes. I'm gonna switch it up a little bit. Try this wacky worm out before it gets dark. See what we can come up with. Well, how about that for a wrong species Wednesday? Got one little bass, didn't even get my hands on him. That's all right. It was still a good time. We, uh, we fished the lake, a few spots at the lake, got some stuff figured out there. And uh, I got a different way to work this jig head with this uh, this grub on the end of it, kind of jerkbait style. And that's pretty much how I caught every single one of the fish today. And I'm gonna keep that tied on, but I think I'm gonna tie it onto the mini rod, the BCL custom little mini rod I got, and just go to town with that. That's always fun to catch fish on. Either way, uh, that, was, that was day 28, no coal. It's gonna be difficult though these next two days trying to get that coal out of the way. And uh, tomorrow I think we're gonna try to hit a spot where that's a little bit more feasible. So, hope you enjoyed the video, and like and subscribe. Leave it down in the comments if you like this tournament series. We're about done with it, and uh, there should be some more. Maybe not as long, but there'll be some more tournament stuff coming up. So, uh, stick around, and uh, brave the weather, y'all. The rain, the wind, make it work in your advantage, because you ain't gonna get fish if you ain't fishing. So, keep your lines tight, rip some lip. We'll see you next time on the Dem Belly Channel.